full time here with our coach Asela uh, Selva. Coach, uh, today we have picked up a very important uh, victory uh, for your side, uh, bounce back of uh, two defeats. Coach, uh, how impressed are you because uh, with the team's uh, performance? Uh, better performance also in first half. We reacted really well to performance we had previously. It was a loss, but it was an improved performance. So, yeah, improved performance, still a lot of things to correct. The second half was. We had bad territory, we couldn't get the ball in the right areas of the pitch to get a platform to play the ball. Yeah, so it's a lot to work on, but good, good improvement for previous performances. Speaking of uh, mistakes, uh, today we saw that our team made, uh, made uh, so many penalties, uh, and then uh, the team, uh, of course, uh, Rhinos have failed to ca capitalize on uh, two o occasions, but they managed to capitalize on, on the other two. Uh, what, what happened with the team's uh, discipline in terms of uh, causing the penalty? Uh, the discipline, to be fair, in second half actually improved because they were we reported about three, four penalties. Unlike the first half, we were about seven or six. But still, the discipline wasn't as, as expected. Uh, the boys were, were not making the right decisions in defense, which is uh, something we keep working on. But well, we have to improve on that because I guess cops or buffaloes, you cannot be uh, giving away penalties for fun like that. The fact that the Akika missed a few kicks, well, that's, that's part of the game, so missed out. So. Zekuye bouncing back and uh, scoring uh, a couple of uh, points, and of course, uh, a match winning uh, pe penalty. How happy are you to have him back, and uh, how, how, how did his performance uh, impress you? Yeah, Benz of Steel, glad to have him back. Uh, still a lot to improve, though, no, but it happens, the rust is expected because there's been no for about three, four weeks. Yeah, we are happy to have him back and uh, we have some points of the good. But still, the boys cannot keep depending on him for points. We have to find another way to score points. We need to score more tries. We score only one to win. So, we still have to go. So, uh, this, this being our final home game, of course, uh, the fans uh, came up in a big number that uh, to us soon. Uh, any message for the fans? Of course, uh, maybe, maybe urge them to travel with the fans on the next uh, two games which are going to be away from, from home. I'd like to thank the fans for the tremendous season they've been having our backs. They've, they've supported us all through, despite our, our not very good performances, especially at home. But uh, we will improve next season. We promise you that. We just pray we keep coming because uh, we're going to keep presenting that very beautiful brand of running that we all love. And uh, thank you to the fans and see you next season. We still have our seven, so we expect them back as well. So the next two games are going to be away from home. And uh, what should we expect uh, from the team? Next week uh, we expect Hunter. Uh, it's going to be a game against Cubs and Legends. A team that wants to win a trophy. They're not going to be laughing around. They're going to take the game very seriously. Uh, so we're going to try our best to defend our uh, hearts out. Try to get good territory with the boots and see what happens. Coach, uh, thank you very much and I uh, wish you the very best in uh, the next game.